Here is a P51 Mustang. This one is a quarter scale. It looks awesome and here it is flying. It's majestic, controlled, and looks like the real thing on the ground and in flight. It's fast but realistically so and the camera can easily track it and keep up with it, as can the pilot and the viewers, including you and me. And now here is the same plane, just 20 times smaller. It's actually a really cool model with an 8-channel control system, yet it is incredibly small. And here it is flying. Kudos to the pilot because this little bird is not easy to see and it is moving very, very fast. In fact, it is moving at a scale speed of about Mach 3, or around 3600 kilometers an hour. Or in other words, about five times faster than a real P-51 Mustang actually flies. The scale speed of small planes are often higher and this can make them more challenging to fly. Also, compared to a small plane, a large one can fly further away from you and you can still see it. And even though the larger plane is usually faster than a smaller one, it will appear to be slower when it is in the distance. Think about an airliner high in the sky that is moving 900 kilometers an hour yet appears to be creeping along. So the faster apparent speed is one reason that smaller RC planes can seem to be more challenging to fly, requiring quicker reactions on the sticks. But that is not the full story. Surely one can make a slower flying plane, right? Well, yes. One way is to make it lighter, or perhaps change the wing design. But there is a downside to a plane that is slow and very light. The issue is wind. A lightweight, slow flyer will get tossed around. Sure, an electronic stabilization system will help a lot, but your plane will still be limited to relatively calm days. So there it is, in case you were wondering why small planes behave differently in the air than bigger ones. I hope that this short video was helpful and thanks for watching. And by the way, if you're interested to learn more about the effects of wind on different RC models, I'm working on an upcoming video covering this topic. Thanks.